Rick Dollar, I'm live on location for NetRadioDogs.com, and we are at the birthplace of Country Music Museum. Um, speaking to Tony Lawson today, um, Tony, what we're looking to uh, talk to you about today is is you guys have a, a, a pretty good size Kickstarter program uh, trying to get your radio station up and going. Um, how's that coming along? Well, this is early on. This is uh, right around the end of the first week. We've gotten off to a really good start. Um, Kickstarter staff has uh, declared us one of their top picks, cool. and we just got put put on their front page today, which is really really nice. Yeah. Uh, yes, it is a very ambitious Kickstarter program. It's a hundred three thousand five hundred dollar goal, and uh, that's to help fund the startup of uh, WBCM Radio Bristol. Cool. Now. Um my past has brought me through the radio industry also, and uh, I have uh, a little bit of, I guess, forethought about, you know, it takes a lot of money to do what you have to do in the radio business, and that's just really all there is to it. Um, but you guys seem to have a, a, a good uh, a good handle on things, and um, where, where are you going as far as, a, um, you know, what kind of music you're going to play, what you're going to be able to do with the station? Can you give us uh, a little bit of an idea about that? Well, we have a very good foundation to build from, and that's uh, the birthplace of Country Music Museum and uh, the Rhythm and Roots uh, Festival. Uh, we want to create a lot of our own content within both of uh, those here at the museum and within the festival. But yeah, give a, a stage to a lot of the, the local artists that are here in East Tennessee, traveling through East Tennessee. Uh, we feel that the, there is a huge interest right now in the Roots music. And we get we're seeing that with Orthophonic Joy. We're seeing that with uh, with other programs that are being uh, built around Roots Music. And you know we we feel pretty good about where we're headed. Uh, it's a new concept. It's a new way of uh, enjoying music and uh, and the programming that we're do, doing here at the museum. And I uh, hope that and I look forward to everybody's comments and hope they enjoy it. Sure. I mean, uh, I see a lot of positive things happening uh, around Bristol just here lately. A lot of really good things going on, and, and the addition of this radio station can only just make it that much better. Um, this is a great place to be. If you don't, if you haven't come down and seen the uh, um, the museum yet, I mean, you're really missing something. Uh, it just brings you through the whole uh, birth of, of country music and, and just uh, roots music uh, itself. And um, it's interactive. Yes, it is, and and that's the one thing about it. Uh, there's a couple of things up here you can really just uh, come in and experience everything, and and you can't do that at every museum that you go to. But music is uh, a, a different animal. It allows you to feel things, to see things, to actually sing. Uh, music is one of the best things in the world to me personally, and uh, but. This Kickstarter program, I think, is is a very ambitious thing. But you guys must be on the right track with what you just told us. Um, what what do you look forward to around Rhythm and Roots? What are you going to be able to do with that uh, festival? Uh, looking forward to all the uh, everyone coming to Bristol, all the musicians here, all the music being played, and us capturing the music and sharing it through uh, the radio station and through our media center on our new website. And uh, we're also building a new app, and that's what. Uh, the money's going for with Kickstarter. We feel that uh, this is, will be a low-power radio station, but today, with uh, you know, with everyone having an Android or an iPhone or or some kind of uh, exactly. way to receive, uh, you know, online, uh, we're we're all neighbors, and uh, you know, accessing the programming is going to be very very easy, and uh, we hope to make it very very enticing and exciting. And uh, it be a statement for what's going on uh, here in Bristol. Yes, it would. Mm -hmm. Yes, it would. Yeah, and and, and that's another thing. Uh, Bristol is being showcased all over the world with this entire project on the corner that I would never thought this would happen here. Uh, growing up here is a totally, you know, totally different thing than now. I mean, my when I grew up. I never thought that Bristol would be able to pull all of these great visitors, have these great music festivals, a million things to do when you come to Bristol. And um, so I, th I think you're going to have uh, quite a bit of success here 
with these guys. Uh, speaking of orthophonic joy, so ha- have we gone gold yet? You know, I I, I don't know. I've been, <laughs> I, I've been I know that Amazon was sold out there for a while. I, yeah. I'm, I'm sure that they probably got restocked. Uh, I think the uh, it, it was very joyful seeing the response to the release. <laughs> uh, everyone was, was very you know, has been very happy. Exactly. Um, and uh, with our Kickstarter program, we have a live. Uh, orthophonic joy uh, set uh, from Houston Fest in Galax from uh, several weeks back uh, with uh, Carl Jackson, uh, the Church Sisters, uh, Marty Stewart, and and more that folks can uh, pledge on our Kickstarter and get that live performance of orthophonic joy. So, uh, uh, there's another good way to share share more of what what we're doing. Yeah, exactly. Well, I'll tell you what. Um, we're just looking forward to the future here. Um, hopefully, Net Radio Dogs can keep being a a, a help to you. And um, so, when everything goes gold or platinum, I'll come back and talk to you again. How's that? <laughs> hey, well, do, if it you know if it does, if it doesn't, come yeah, back, exactly. Come back and uh, talk with us. Yes, uh, this is a. Uh, a very very exciting time and uh personally i'm very very uh happy to be here all right all right that's tony lawson here with uh uh the birthplace of country music museum and uh it's a big time to be in bristol it's rick dollar with netradiodogs.com and we're live on location in bristol tennessee